Hi, my name is Jatin Popat. I'm a lawyer by profession and I've been giving legal services for past 30 years. I'm also founder of a company called Will Genie, which is India's first succession services company. And we have been providing will and succession services to thousands of uh, Indians which are, who are residing in India or abroad, like NRIs, since 2014. Today I want to uh, cover one uh, brief topic on registration of a will. Now, let me take you through uh, very basic uh, information on this and will help you to understand it very clearly, uh, what is the need and uh, how to be done. Now, registration of a will or a notarization, there are two documents uh, uh, attestation by independent people. So, why uh, it is to be done, whether it is mandatory? So, it is not mandatory. Once you have a will with the two witnesses, it is not mandatory you should have a registration or maybe notary. Now, notary is something a lawyer who has been appointed by government as a notary public, he is a professional lawyer outside of the family who is also uh, attesting your will in his presence. So there is an independent law professional appointed by government has attested your will, which is called a notarization. Like it happens uh, everywhere in India with the local uh, court also have notary public. One step ahead for the more strengthening of the will, the registration. Now the registration is happening in a local sub-register office where you do property registration and those stuff, right? So when you visit registration uh, office with the will registration, you have to see that you have the original will, the documents and two witnesses. The witnesses can be different than your will. It can be same also. So there is no problem. Two people need it there. Now registration of will, though it is not mandatory, but when you do it, you are adding a government department or a government also in your will who you register your will as a when you personally visit it. So the authenticity on, on your will questions can be reduced. So nobody can then say this is a fake will or this is a forged will because you made your will at home and next day or maybe after a month or maybe after a year till your lifetime you can go and do registration. So, uh, registration process itself is uh, something which you have to do to the sub office. There is a process which happens uh, with the prior appointment. So, there is a, a local consultant who helps you to get it done. There is a, a, no hardly any cost they charge, but the process itself requires certain steps or certain documents. And uh, there are the professional people who are there to help you out. Uh, people, uh, the companies like us also provide such services uh, all over India with a nominal charge that we charge. And uh, this way, it is uh, smoothen your process of uh, identifying which office you have to go, which uh, department you have to go, what document you have to submit, how much time you have to wait, taking prior approval, uh, appointment, all these things that we help. Uh, similarly, the uh, registration office, when you visit, uh, everything goes smoothly and you get your document very uh, uh, quickly, uh, which way uh, by uh, you are saving some uh, good amount of time and effort by appointing a, uh, a agency who are helping you. Now, when you when you uh, when you to go for registration, when you sign a will today in your house and you are deciding to do a registration, so please note the registration of any other legal document can be done within four months. But the will is the only document which government is allowed to do during your lifetime. So anytime during lifetime, even after five years, 10 years, you can go and do a registration if you don't make a new will. Even that same will, you can go. Now, that way, uh, the registration when you do, it is government keeping one copy with them themselves and they give original back to you. So the registration will, will be uh, used by the court if the will original will is not getting found and the family says the will is registered, the court can order the registrar to provide the registered will copy, which can be used for the distribution of the asset of a will. So this way, the process can be uh, add you no know, authenticity and uh, very smooth uh, distribution to your family, and uh, it really helps. Uh, I hope uh, these uh, brief details will help you to understand about registration. Thank you.